Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to my complete guide to the standard 5-star character Himiko. In this guide, we'll be covering how to use, build, and where to use her. Himiko is a 5-star erudition fire character whose main strength is area damage. Her main purpose is to quickly defeat groups of enemies or weakness break targets. Her first skill, Sawblade Tuning, does single damage to an opponent based on her attack. Pretty simple overall. Her skill, Molten Detonation, deals damage to the main target, with lesser damage being dealt to adjacent enemies, which is useful for weakness breaking multiple targets. But its damage is not super high to the main target. It does, however, do about approximately twice as much damage as her basic attack. Himiko's ultimate is Heavenly Fire, where she drinks tea while doing a large amount of area damage and regenerating for every enemy defeated. Her talent, Victory Rush, causes her to stack charges when an enemy's weakness is broken, and when at three charges and an ally attacks, she performs a follow-up attack with a pizza cutter doing extra damage and consuming her charges. She also starts battle with one charge. Finally, her technique out of combat is Incomplete Combustion. When used, creates a field that causes enemies to take 10% increased fire damage for two turns when combat is triggered. Next are her main traces, which are upgrades to her character and abilities. Her first trace allows her attack to have a 50% chance to burn the enemy for two turns, doing 30% of her attack every turn. Her second trace allows her to deal 20% more damage if they're burned. Her final trace increases her crit rate by 15% when her health is 80% or higher. Himiko's Eidolons increase her speed after her talent, deal more damage when enemies are at 50% health or lower, increase her skill level, gain additional charge when breaking weakness, increase her ultimate level, and finally her ultimate hits two additional times on two random enemies. If there's only one enemy, it will hit them twice. It's recommended that you use her light cone, Knight on the Milky Way, as it perfectly supports her main strengths, area damage and fast clear. Every enemy increases her damage, and after breaking their weakness, she gets a large damage boost for his turn as well. However, if you don't have it, one could always use uh, another light cone, such as Genius's Repose or Make the World Clamor, as they both benefit her main purpose, which is heavy area damage and fast clear. Himiko's main relics are the Firesmith set. They increase her fire and skill damage, which perfectly complements her. The best secondary set would most likely be the Space Ceiling set, which increases her attack, and when you get enough speed, increases it again. As for what main stats Himiko wants, she mainly focuses on pure damage to clear, so one can use attack or crit main stats on her body armor and boots. As for substats, she should be focusing on attack, crit chance, crit damage, and speed. There's also the possibility that focusing on speed boots for weaker enemies can allow her to clear them extra fast and always take the first turn when you enter combat, which could be more efficient when farming materials. Himiko's main purpose is doing area damage and weakness breaking, so make sure to use her when farming for these materials or when a boss has extra adds, and especially make sure that they're all weak to fire. Her talent allows her to sometimes completely destroy a pack of mobs as soon as you enter combat just for getting the drop of the enemy with an attack that the enemy is weak to. You don't ever really want to do her basic attack as it's low damage and only single target, so make sure that you save skill points to always be able to use her skill every time it's her turn. It can also be important to focus weakness breaking the weaker enemies so that Himiko is able to use her talent a little bit more often with the pizza cutter. Also, since she's able to place burns upon any attack or weakness break, higher attack can possibly benefit her in some situations more than crit, as burns don't really scale off crit damage, however keeping her at high health increases her crit chance, so it can very much be worthwhile protecting her with the shield as well. Himiko's downsides are a lack of single target strong damage, and no real team utility whatsoever. Make sure that you support her with an ally that allows her to shine. Either damage boosters or strong single target damage dealers to accompany her. That's all for now, and I hope this video helped you in some way. Don't forget to like the video or subscribe to the channel, and I hope to see you next time.